Hi students, good morning to all of you. Today, I explain about male reproductive unit in flowering plant. So, it is a stamen. A stamen is the male reproductive part in flower and this stamen has two components, has two parts. One is anther and the second filament. What is anther? Anther is by low structure that is male reproductive part. And what is filament? Filament is a long part, cylinder part, either free or united. Now we focus what is the structure of anther? Anther कैसे लगता है देखने में? Anther की रचना कैसे होती है? So we look this figure. This is a stamen. Since stamen has two parts, one is anther and the second filament. So there is by low structure that is anther and long cylindrical part that is filament. Anther and filament both is known as Esther May. Now we look <coughs> the detailed structure of Esther May here. Look at this figure. There is one pollen sac here and one pollen sac is here. How many pollen sacs? Pollen sacs are two in number. And each pollen sac, one microsporangium, this microspore, this project, and so there are four micros, and there are four microspore are present now. Two pollen sacs, this one and this one, two pollen sacs. Is connected by the line of dehens. Line of dehens जो है दो दोनों pollen sacs को connect करता है. There is line of dehens and this line of dehens and the second uh, each pollen sac has two loop. One is and one is. How many? Two loop. It means that anther is biloped structure and this biloped structure of anther is connected with septum. Is septum is connected. Okay. Now we focus later on. Now the students, the next point. Structure of microsporangium. Just we have uh, talked in anther, there are microsporangium that are four in numbers are present. So that's why we look structure of microsporangium. Each microsporangium is made up of four layers one is epidermis second endothesium third middle layer and fourth and fourth septum so that's here the structure of microsporangium look this diagram the first layer of cell this is the first layer this is the first layer name epidermis Second layer that is endothesium and third, fourth, both layer, middle layer because middle layer are in two or three in number. And next, after middle layer that is the innermost layer, these are what is this? Peptum. 
ये सारा टेप्टम नहीं आता है इसको लोग टेप्टम लेयर बोलते हैं जो इनर मोस्ट लेयर एंड इन साइड टेप्टम देर आर माइक्रोस्पोर सेक्स वॉट आर देर आर माइक्रोस्पोर यूल आर माइक्रोस्पोर इन साइड टेप्टम नाउ ऑल्सो द सेकेंड फिगर दिस इज ऑल्सो सो इज द माइक्रोस्पोरजियम दिस epidermis second layer endothelium third layer middle layer and here the round structure this is tectum and how many 1 2 3 4 there are four tectum and on the above side ऊपर की ओर बिटवीन है ना टू टेप्टर देर इज कनेक्टिव कनेक्टिव टिश्यू कनेक्टिव लेयर या कनेक्टिव टिश्यू सो आफ्टर ऑब्जर्विंग बोथ डायग्राम वी एक्सप्लेन फर्स्ट एपिडर्मिस एपिडर्मिस इज द आउटर लेयर ऑफ द माइक्रोस्पोरियम व्हिच हेल्प्स इन द प्रोटेक्शन next me second layer is endothelium also helps in protection as well as helps in defense middle layer that is the third layer just below the endothelium endothelium and you can see that just niche kaun sa layer hai middle layer that are two in number or three in number also helps in protection and also defense next that is the last and the innermost layer this is septum two septum layer and innermost layer and what is the function of this layer this layer provides nutrients to the developing polyps as well as in the protection okay